Get the upper hand on your competition with scuff controllers. Use code OGXRACE to get 5% off your entire order. Yo guys, what's up? It's x -Rays. Welcome back to another Fortnite video. Now, as you guys can see, I just landed in a new location with a brand new Rift portal. Now, this location is found just over by Greasy Grove right over here on the mountain. And uh, back here is where you can see that gigantic footprint that has been used in challenges in the past. But we have a brand new portal. Now, the very interesting thing about this is that we have had portals before. But they've mostly been placed there to remove some sort of landmark. So, for instance, we had one location over in Greasy Grove that removed the burger from their burger. We've had Tomato Town where they removed the tomato. Uh, Lonely Lodge, they removed the sign for Lonely Lodge. And then the motel, they completely got rid of the motel sign as well. So, it's strange that we have a brand new rift, but there's nothing here to remove. So because of this, there's a lot of people who are speculating a couple of things. The first one, maybe it's just going to remove grass for no apparent reason. But as we all know, there seems to be a purpose for each one of these every time, whether it was removing a landmark or removing a sign. And so if it's supposed to do that, maybe this is the opposite. Maybe instead of removing something like it has been in the past, since there's nothing here, maybe it's actually going to add something new. Now, Personally, I am super hyped and super excited and, and super happy with what they've been doing with these portals. They've been kind of slowly updating the map over the last few days. The uh, the crack that is in the sky is getting way bigger. You guys can see it started just over here. The crack expanded over here now. So uh, it's, it's kind of adding more to the storyline, the lore, what's going to happen in Season 5. These small changes where they're having these little portals around the map and they're removing stuff is also pretty huge. I'm, I'm very, very excited for that. So we might be seeing something added here from a different time period. If we do see something like that here in the future, that would be very, very interesting. Now, I kind of started looking around here because I just realized that I've never really walked around this area, but there's a house up there. There's a car right over here. Um, I don't think there's anything special to this car. Uh, we have a special uh vending machine over here and then a special path that runs over this way so there's a house up there but nothing really of importance over here so it's, it's very very strange that we have this this portal so again like i was saying we might be seeing something appearing over here as opposed to you know something like disappearing i don't think we're gonna suddenly lose grass i think it's more likely that we're going to see something new put there whether it's a statue whether maybe it's a creature maybe maybe that big old leviathan theory that everyone has had is actually going to come true and we're going to get some sort of uh some sort of creature you know especially since we do have that footprint right over here it just seems rather convenient that a new portal has shown up right where that um that special footprint is at so who knows maybe we will be something uh, seeing something here all right guys so i did a little bit of construction over here and this is what we might be seeing we might be seeing uh, either a new location or they might be adding a statue or something but uh we just added a little house here with a nice little ramp over this way uh it looks pretty cool i think that we might be seeing something like this obviously the rift portal type thing is still in here it's it's located right in this spot like usual but this is what we might be seeing. We might be seeing a little house or something being added now to this side of the map. Uh, whether it's a statue or something else, it'll be interesting. Whether it destroys something, which I don't think it will because there is nothing to destroy. But I still think that it's rather interesting that uh, we have a portal over here. And hopefully we discover even more because I think it'll be pretty awesome to see something like that uh, here in the future. Yo guys, so I was ending that last video or editing this one. I don't know where I'm going to put this part uh, in the video. But someone actually found the Der Burger burger sign out in the middle of the desert somewhere. And I think this might be like guerrilla marketing by Epic Games for Season 5. So I'm going to go ahead and put the image on screen. And there was also a video of a cop car along with like a pan over to the Der Burger sign. Now this is all courtesy of Selah Shitoni on Twitter. Now this guy apparently was just kind of roaming around in the middle of the desert. Uh, just I guess just like to the side of the road or whatever. And he spotted something and it was the Der Burger burger logo <laughs> along with Fortnite. Now this guy didn't know it was from Fortnite tweeted it out and then started tweeting and saying that people are saying this was from a game called Fortnite. So it's all pretty insane. It's pretty insane. It looks like, uh, if I had to guess, this is probably a tease from Epic Games that the next area that we're going to get a point of view is going to be a desert type map. One would assume this just because of the fact that it's out in the middle of the desert somewhere and because of the fact that uh, why would they spend money getting these things created and just randomly put them out there somewhere for someone to find. So I think, first of all, 
pretty awesome marketing. Uh, second of all, I'm pretty surprised that someone actually found this guy. Uh, and middle of the desert, what exactly could it mean? It's all very, very interesting. Uh, let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below. But it does look like this next map that we're going to get from Epic Games, or at least I should say maybe not new map, but maybe more so uh, new additions, new point of interest. Some of them might be just a desert biome. So we'll definitely see about that. Let me know how you guys feel about a desert biome now. There has already been a desert biome that was added to the Save the World portion of the game. And I'll try to put some gameplay up of that if I can. But it's it's pretty cool. It's pretty interesting that we might see something like this in Fortnite now added maybe to a portion of the map. I always thought it was uh, interesting that we didn't have a desert area or maybe even like a frozen area. Considering just how big the map is. You have like a swamp area that they're getting rid of. Uh, according to leaks, Moisty Mire probably going to be removed. Maybe that'll be the new desert biome. Maybe, I don't know. But uh, it was always interesting to me that we didn't have more different like styles like a desert or you know like a frozen tundra or like frozen mountains area. So it'll be interesting. We'll definitely see about that. But I just wanted to make a quick portion of this video to let you guys know about this because this could potentially be huge news for what is coming here in Season 5 of Fortnite which is some desert area so we'll definitely see about that guys but anyways thank you so much for watching the video hopefully you guys did enjoy it if you did drop a like drop a favor on the video guys it's super super appreciated and incredibly helpful and if you're new to the channel if you want to see even more content like this then obviously make sure you guys do subscribe and turn on notifications by slapping that bell icon next to the sub button so you don't miss a single upload from me secondly guys if you guys do want to support the channel directly you guys can do so by joining my sponsor squad you get access to early content exclusive videos and a special badge that shows up in all my live streams in the comment sections of all my videos so check that out only if you are willing and able to and then if you want to talk or anything twitter honestly the best place to do so constantly on there go ahead and give me a follow over there and talk to me over there and i'll also have links to my gaming a second channel for more content but anyways you guys have an absolutely amazing day take care guys i'm out peace